Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Now today we're going to be doing the best Skeledurge build for our raids on Pokemon Scarlet and Violet. Now this Pokemon was requested. I didn't actually know we didn't actually finish the trio of just like builds having their own video each. So we're going to do that now. And we have Skeledurge with the fire type Terra and the held item Shell Bell to restore health. The more damage we deal, you can get it from the Lavincia Daily Bro Shop. You can also set up with the Throat Spray. But after it's one use, it will raise your special attack by plus two after the first turn along with Torch Song. So Torch Song gives you plus one and the item will give you plus one. But after that, it's pretty useless. So that's why we've chose to go with the Shell Bell. EVs in special attack and HP. Modest nature to increase that special attack even more and then max IVs and everything except attack because we don't use it and the ability is going to be the hidden ability unaware if they boost their special defense it won't affect us in any way and we'll just keep doing big damage because some of them Pokemon do have amnesia. Move set is going to be Torch Song, 80 power, 100 accuracy, it's the signature move, raises our special attack every time we attack. We have Snarl to lower their special attack, Will-O-Wisp to lower their attack when they haven't got the shield up and Sunny Day to boost their own power if needed or if we're against a water type that also comes in handy. So we do have quite a difficult one here. It's going to really put Skeledurge to the test. It's a six star bug type. Garganical, I think it's called. There we go. Took a minute to remember it. Well, it does. It is a rock type, so this should be very difficult. Let's begin and just see how we can defeat it. Let's just begin and see how it goes. Do we have any Intimidate users? No, but we do have a Drifling who can also burn it. So, first things first, Will-O-Wisp is going straight out there. I do not want to be dealing with those Stone Edges. Stone Edges? Stone... Yeah, Stone Edge. There we go, now it's not doing as much. And then we're going to start to set up our Special Attack a little bit. I think when we get to plus two, maybe plus three, we'll use Sunny Day. Depends how much health we're on as well. He just cannot crit our we're in big trouble. Another Torch on, doing a bit more every single time. So our special attack is now on plus two. The only difference with the throat spray is that you would be on plus three now instead of plus two. Okay, so a sandstorm's out. So I think now's the perfect time to just put Sunny Day up anyway to take over the sandstorm. His stone edge misses, that is huge. I think it has 80% accuracy, so that was bound to happen eventually. Unless we got really lucky, of course. This one is going to do a lot of damage. There we go. Sunny's out, so 50% more damage as well as our special attack increasing every single turn. This is with a stone edge. We should go back up to full health here because it said terrestrialize as well. I'm hoping we can get the shield down before he nullifies us. I think he nullifies when there's about a third left. I'm gonna terrestrialize here and use our next torch song. Here we go, let's see how much damage this does. It does just under half the shield, so our next attack will probably almost break the shield. Back up to full health almost, that's great. He removes negative effects from himself, so he's no longer burnt. So he's gonna do a lot of damage again. So we've got half our health in damage. We need to get the shield down as quick as possible. Oh, he's poisoned now as well. Oh, it's gone. I don't know what happened to that. We nearly break the shield. One more attack. Should do it. Is this where he's going to nullify us, though? He uses Stone Edge again. Okay, I need to hurry up before he does nullify. One more attack. Oh, he nullified. Does that mean it cancelled our attack? I'm sure I clicked it. Did he break the shield? Yes, it just broke the shield. But is that going to get us enough health back that we survive this attack? Hmm, I'm not sure. It's going to be close. Stone Edge, 11 health. 19. Okay. The shield does break. We kind of get a free attack here, so I'm just going to use Torch Song. We can't really burn him at the minute anyway, because uh, the actual Clodsire poisoned him. Oh, he uses Rock Slide. That must be a trigger move. That was unfortunate. But it's not going to be too big of a deal, because when we come back, we'll still have enough time where we can just finish him off. If only we could burn him. So we know that we'll get free attacks. So that should be enough. Unless he crits, of course. But I think one more attack will do it. There's his Stone Edge. He doesn't crit, so we're pretty much uh, in the money here. This should finish him off, and boom. Oh, it's not finished him off, but the air flash from the Drifflin does. Taking down a rock type that just spams Stone Edge, and we did well. We wanted to get one more attack in, didn't we? I'd call that a huge success anyway. We even got a Salty Herb and Mystica. So that's going to be our Skeledurge. If you want to check out the last build we did, it was a Superior. Arguably the best grass type on this game. I'll put it on screen right now. Smash the like button if you have enjoyed this video, it does go a long way. Subscribe and turn on the notification bell so you don't miss another build, and I'll catch you on the next one.